Our second recipe in the Thai series is Tom Yam soup with seafood. We're going to use shrimps, uh, squid and in our case sea bream but it can be uh, sea bass or sea bream fillet of the fish. Oh, We're going yeah. to start uh, cutting up uh, the vegetables. What okay. are we doing first? Yeah. Uh, lemongrass we can buy frozen in our shops. Mm -hmm. It's very commonly used in uh, Thai cuisine. Okay. We cut the top and we make small pieces. Cut okay. also. A fresh one as well. Yes. And we need to and hit the lemongrass a few times yeah. to okay. extract the, yeah, the, the smell uh, aroma. Out of it. Yes, aroma. the aroma coming, out of the lemongrass. The oil coming yeah. here. So yes. we can actually eat yes. lemongrass yeah. fresh like this and it's very healthy for us. Uh -huh. So the outside layer that we already uh, removed yeah. we can use but only for the stock for the soup, yeah. for the soup so we don't can. eat it but we will yeah. put it in the water in our uh, soup mm -hmm. uh, to make it uh, more flavorful yeah. galangal okay. is just another type of uh, ginger okay. again nothing gets wasted we can use mm -hmm. these uh, for the stock as well okay. it's a uh, yeah, it's quite similar to ginger, but it has different, still yeah, different, yes. different More aroma. So okay. we put our galangal as well. Okay. Kefir lime leaves. Yes. Something okay. So we first need to clean okay. the middle, mid, mid stem. Yeah. Okay. Just so here. the oils will come out yeah. once we tear it apart before adding okay. it to the soup. I but it's already a fantastic aroma okay. of. Uh, lime base. Some more. Very similar. More? Yeah. Yes. Okay. okay. And champignon. Then some mushrooms. Yeah. Okay, so in Thailand it would mostly be cut like this in like uh, um, smaller chunks. Yeah. But uh, you, it can also be just sliced. Lime is more often used in Thai cuisine if I'm not mistaken yes. than lemon. Yeah. Okay. So mostly it's used lime. Okay. A bit different. Just here and the chili. Okay. For mm -hmm. you. Okay. Are you like hot oh. and spicy? Yes, I like hot, but just a <laughs> this is Thai chili, so it's a bit. <laughs> we keep the seeds in. That's okay. It's taste okay. and uh, smell is okay, good. Okay, so in just a few chunks like this. So <laughs> the smaller the pieces, <laughs> spicier the, the okay. soup in the end. Okay. And some coriander, of course. Yes. Okay. okay. Good. Just cut. To, yeah. yeah. Can I just uh, roughly yeah. chop it or? Not. No. Okay. Okay. That's okay. Now for the fish. You okay, want to take care of the yeah, sea bream? Yeah. Are we just cutting yeah, a few, casting here. few pieces of okay. sea and bream? Here. Like this big? That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. That here born already. Okay, good. I just... Mm -hmm. Like in three. So what do we do with the tops? No, 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 not small. That's, sorry, yeah. sorry. Let's show me. Just mm -hmm. enough. Hopefully. Okay, so we don't need Some, to mind two, like two small pieces. So yeah. nice That's things. Here. Okay. Easy way for cleaning the shrimp head. Okay. So we cut the head. And, and after that? After that we are left with only the meat. Now we are ready to finish our soup. As you will see with many Thai dishes, it's all in the prep. So once we do the prep work, the cooking will be fast and very simple. So we are going to have this soup on our table in five to eight minutes basically how much we need to cook our fish because the fish is going to go in first so now we're going to add the fish our uh, galangal and lemongrass to the soup first galangal and lemongrass now we're going to add the sea bream nicely poach the sea bream we close the lid sea bream needs the most then we're going to add the squid and uh, mushrooms and in the end we're going to add our uh, shrimps because they need literally a minute in the meantime we're going to prepare yeah. that lovely thing that gives us a uh, red color and those are the heads uh, of our shrimps first we need a small pan turn the heat okay, cool. one two tablespoon of oil yeah. in the pan we heat up the oil and this will take no time to change color. Just yeah. It's already started to turn uh, red color. Already starting to get that beautiful color that will give 
the final color to our soup. We are going to add this at the very end together with our uh, shrimps. Here we are like two, two minutes in. By the way, what I forgot to say is that our base of just water, lemongrass, galangal is actually great tea. Without cooking the soup, we can already have a great cup of tea. Mushrooms and the squid. Okay, how much do we need? And then our mushrooms. All of our mushrooms going. You can actually see that beautiful red color that will give the final look to our soup. This is uh, ready and it's... A little bit more. Yeah. Okay. okay. Almost ready. It will be ready by the time we actually add the shrimp and um, and lime leaves. So these are the, our, our two last ingredients to the soup. Uh, we are waiting for, what, two more minutes before we add the shrimp. Before we add the soup, we are going to start in our plate, we are going to add two tablespoons yes. of fish sauce. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. About One. Okay, so we are adding also three yeah. tablespoons of fish sauce in our broth. Yeah. Okay, thank you. One, wow. two, so all the shrimp goes in. Yes. Okay, so we added two tablespoons of fish sauce and then uh, half a lime or Yeah, two half and lime. three spoon, uh, same for lime. For lime, okay. Okay, we need? We need to add the yes. heads. Yeah, yes. Okay, we are not actually using the whole uh, shrimp Mixer, mixture to add to the soup, but just half because half will be for our decoration at the end while serving. Okay, it's changing the color, right? Yeah. Yes, sir. You can see that it's changing the colors straight away of the soup. Now, at the very end, we are adding a few lime leaves. Okay. We are going to share this because we need to uh, yeah. cut them a little bit in our hand, like this. You can eat all. Yeah. You, it, we can eat it raw. Yes. Wow. Yes. The soup is done and we're going to serve it now. Let's bring it here. Okay, let's take this off. Can I, can I, can I? Mm -hmm. Yes, it's amazing. Okay. okay. Wish you could smell this, but yeah. doesn't go on camera. Okay. So now we put a few ladles inside our mixture of fish sauce and, and lime. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's so good. So there we have it. This is the second recipe in the series, the Tom Yum soup. Hot, spicy, but very, very, very healthy.